Unit 3, Lesson 15. Finding this percent of that. Number 1. A. To find 40% of 75, Priya calculates 2 fifths times 75. Does her calculation give the correct value for 40% of 75? Explain or show how you know. I'll show you how you can use a calculator to solve this. 2 divided by 5 times 75 equals 30. That's the same as 40% times 75 equals 30. Or 40% 40 of 75 is 30. So yes, Priya's calculation does give the correct value for 40% of 75. B. If x represents a number, does 2 fifths times x always represent 40% of that number? Explain your reasoning. Yes, 2 fifths times x equals 40% of x. 2 fifths is the same thing as 4 tenths, which equals 40 hundredths, which is the same as 40%. So 2 fifths times x is 40% of x just like 4 tenths times x would be 40% of x, or 40 hundredths times x would equal 40% of x. Number 2. Han spent 75 minutes practicing the piano over the weekend. For each question, explain or show your reasoning. A. Priya practiced the violin for 15 and 2 tenths as much time as Han practiced the piano. Priya practiced the violin for 152% as much time as Han practiced the piano. How long did she practice? 152% times 75 equals 114. She practiced 114 minutes. B. Tyler practiced the clarinet for 64% as much time as Han practiced the piano. How long did he practice? 64% times 75 equals 48. Han practiced for 48 minutes. Number 3. Last Sunday, 1,575 people visited the amusement park. 56% of the visitors were adults, 16% were teenagers, and 28% were children ages 12 and under. Find the number of adults teenagers, and children that visited the park. 56% times 1,575 equals 882. 882 of the visitors were adults. 16% times 1,575 equals 252. 252 of the visitors were teenagers. 28% times 1,575 equals 441. 441 of the visitors to the amusement park were children ages 12 and under. Number 4. Order from greatest to least. 55% of 180. 55% times 180 equals 99. 300% of 26. 3 times 26 equals 78. 300% of 26 is 78. Looking down here at the bottom, we see 12% of 700. 12% times 700 equals 84. 12% of 700 equals 84. First, you have 55% of 180. Second, you have 12% of 700. And third, you have 300% of 26. Number five, complete each statement. A, 20% of 60 is 12. 20% 20 times 60 equals 12. B. 25% of what number is 6? Six? 6 divided by 25% equals 
equals 24. 25% 25 of 24 is 6. C. What percent of 100 is 14? 14 divided by 100 equals 14%. 14% of 100 is 14. D. 50% of 90 is what number? 50% of 90 is 45. 50% of 90 is 45. E. 10% of what number is 7? Seven? 7 divided by 10% is 70. 7 divided by 10% is 70 and 10% of 70 is 7. F. 30% of 70 is what number? 30% of 70 is 21. Let's compare the equations at the bottom. 30 hundredths is the same as 30%, and times means the same thing as of. We could substitute the equal sign with the word is. For example, 30% of 70 is 21. Number 6. A shopper needs 24 sandwich rolls. The store sells identical rolls in two differently sized packages. They sell a 6-pack for $5.28 and a 4-pack for $3.40. Should the shopper buy 4 6-packs or 6 4-packs? Explain your reasoning. $5.28 divided by 6 for the 6-pack equals 88 cents per roll. The 6-pack sells the rolls for 88 cents each. $3.40 divided by 4 equals 85 cents. The 4-pack sells the rolls for 85 cents each. The best deal is the four pack, selling the rolls for 85 cents each. Number seven. On a field trip, there are three chaperones for every 20 students. There are 92 people on the trip. Answer these questions. If you get stuck, consider using a tape diagram. A. How many chaperones are there? And B. How many children are there? Well, I created a tape diagram with the number of chaperones counting by 3 across the top in green and the number of students counting by 20 across the bottom in blue. Originally, it says that there were 3 chaperones for every 20 students. So if you notice below the 3 on the left, it says that there's 20 students. So 3 chaperones paired with 20 students. Next to it on the right, it says 6 chaperones to 40 students followed by 9 chaperones to 60 students, and then 12 chaperones to 80 students. Well, 12 plus 80 equals 92, and they said that there were 92 people on the field trip. So to answer the question, A, how many chaperones are there? There's 12 chaperones. And to answer the question, B, how many children are there? There are 80 children. Congratulations, you have completed Unit 3, Lesson 15, Finding This Percent of That. Here's your opportunity to show your appreciation. Hit that subscribe button in the middle and visit Patreon on the left. What are you waiting for? Hurry, hit it!